Hi everybody, it's Miss Tracy here from the Clarkston Independence District Library. We miss you so much and we just wanted to let you know that Summer Reading 2020 Imagine Your Story is right around the corner. So if you want to watch this slideshow, we'll tell you all about the fun reading program that we're doing, the prizes that you can win, the programs that you can attend virtually throughout the summer, and all sorts of other fun information. Yes, we are doing summer reading. It will be online through WANDU, as it has been the last couple of years. We'll talk about signing up in a few minutes. We will have programs for you to attend, complete with grab bags that will have all the things in them that you need to complete the activities that we'll show you. Those programs will be structured the way that they were in the previous years for all age groups. Um, Tuesdays, we'll have preschool story time with Miss Jamie, just like we've been doing, but Miss Jamie will also be including some grab bag activities for people to pick up from the library. Um, we will be having kindergarten through second grade programs. Those will be with Miss Christie, and those will be on Wednesdays. Um, and we will also be having programs for third through fifth graders with Miss Tina, as she's done in the previous couple of years, and those will be on Mondays. And remember, that's the grade you'll be in next year. And you'll also want to take a look at our calendar to find out what time those programs will be happening. Although we think we'll have them recorded, so even if you miss the live program, you can still pick up a grab bag and do the fun activities later. But we'll talk about that. We'll also still have some fun performances, although they will be virtual, from places like Fairy Tale Entertainment and Be with Beauty and the Beast and the magician Joel Tacey and um, several others that we're still working on planning. So once again, that's where the calendar comes in. Okay, so sign up for summer reading begins on June 15th um, at 8 o'clock in the morning. You can sign up anytime since it's online. Um, anytime is fine. You can find the link to register on our homepage of our website. It's not there yet, but it will be there um, around the, just sometime during the first week in June. This year, we're going to have 24 different grand prizes for people to try and win by earning raffle entries, by completing challenges, and by what? Reading, that's right. This year, when you register, there's something that's going to be a little bit different. You will pick the one prize that you want to compete for right away. You can only put your raffle entries into one prize, um, and the computer will do it all for you, and you're going to have to pick that prize right when you register. So we will be giving you a link to a slideshow of all the prizes with their corresponding numbers, so you will be ready to choose. Our programs have gone virtual but they do have a fun in real life component, grab bags. Let me tell you about our programs real quick. So our weekly programs for kids that we've done every year for summer reading since I've been around um, will still be happening, but online. Hopefully we'll be doing Facebook watch parties with them. Um, we're not sure what time yet, so keep your eye out on the calendar. Uh, for those exact details, but I will tell you that our preschool programs will be happening on Tuesdays and with Miss Jamie. Our kindergarten through second grade programs will be happening on Wednesdays with Miss Christie, and our third through fifth grade programs will be happening on Mondays with Miss Tina. And I'll be around too doing some uh, baby and toddler story times on Thursdays, like I have been doing. Let me explain grab bags. So we hope we're going to be able to do grab bags for you to pick up to do with your programs. These bags will contain all the materials that we would be using we will be using in our videos of our programs so you can do whatever it is whatever activity it is or craft it is that we're doing right along with us um we're hoping that soon we are allowed to provide curbside service to our patrons we don't know yet when that will be right now the governor's orders are such that we cannot um we cannot provide curbside service yet, but we're hoping that her as her orders ease we'll be able to do that and that's how we're planning our summer reading so the grab bags would be able to would you would be able to pick up the grab bags for your programs the Friday before the week that your program is going to happen and that way you'll have all the materials ready to go and do those do those activities with us so you have to register for each program that way we can write your name on the grab bag put all your supplies in it and it'll be ready for you to pick up the Friday before the week of the program and I wanted to let you know that if you attend three programs you can earn a raffle entry for one of the grand prizes so remember to check out the calendar pretty frequently. If we update information, that's going to be the first place where it shows up. 
and it will have all the dates and times of the programs that you might want to attend virtually. Um, the link for that is at the top of the page, and you can always get to it from CIDlibrary.org by clicking on the Events tab. I'm going to turn it over to Ms. Tina, Ms. Elena, Ms. Jamie, and Ms. Christy to tell you about their respective um, age group programs that will be going on throughout the weeks during summer. The age group will be at the top of the slide, so if you're just interested in finding about which programs are available for you specifically, check out that slide. But you might want to listen to everything just to see how much fun maybe your brothers and sisters or your friends or your neighbors might be having um, along with you. Hello everyone, Miss Jamie here. I'm super excited to tell you about Shrek Storytime, a preschool storytime that I will be leading this summer. Shrek Storytime will be a continuation of the fun story times that we've been doing already on Facebook Live. They will take place on Tuesdays at 10.30 a.m. and you can just sign in to Clarkston Independence District Library's Facebook page to watch them. Each week we'll have a different fun theme like Merlin's Magic, Fairy Tales, Cook Me a Story, Dragons and Unicorns, and Imagine You're a Superhero. Each story time will include stories, songs, and felt boards, just like regular in-person story times. And I will still post titles of similar books to read and crafts on the Youth Services blog like I have been doing. The only thing that's going to be different is that we're hoping to have grab bags of craft supplies that you can take home so that you can do the crafts at home. When the governor says that it's okay for libraries to provide curbside service, we'd like to start having grab bags full of crafts that you can take home. Most of the crafts that I use in my story times can easily be adapted to use simple supplies that you can find around your house. But if you don't have those supplies, or if you would like to have all the supplies in one spot ready to go, we will have the grab bags available for you. If you would like a grab bag, register for the story time online or by calling the library, and the grab bag will be available starting the Friday before story time. Please do not register for story time unless you're interested in a grab bag. Anyone's welcome to watch story time on Facebook Live the registration is only for the craft gap grab bags. Hello, my Hercules heroes, kindergartners through second graders. It's Miss Christy, and get ready for our summer adventures every Wednesday at 11. We're going to explore the wonderful world of Imagine Your Story. On June 24th, we're going to start with Merlin's Magic. Get ready for some new versions of fairy tale classics, and then we'll dive right into those twisted stories and create some dragons and houses for pigs and even a beanstalk to climb. On July 8th, it's time for the very first fairy tale games. Get ready to get moving and shaking as we compete for honor, valor, and fun. There'll be all kinds of wild games and you'll have the chance to earn the coveted bracelet of victory. Okay, Hercules heroes, are you ready to cook up some fun? On July 15th, we're going to mix up some mermaid lemonade, make some repretzels, and decorate our own aprons and chef's hat while we enjoy some interactive stories too. I'll read part of a story You'll mix in an ingredient. In the end, it's a recipe for fun. And the following week, July 22nd, we're going to have some staff from the Painted Pot in Rochester leading us in creating some fairy tale themed mosaics. You'll get the chance to select a sword or a crown on your registration and get ready to create a one of a kind craft. Okay, Hercules heroes. After a summer of reading amazing collection of books, meeting those summer reading program challenges, it's time to celebrate. On July 29th, we're going to have an interactive story beach party. You get to choose if you want to be a mermaid or a shark and enjoy some crafts, squirt gun fun, recipes for themed snacks, and of course, oceans and oceans of fun. Can't wait to celebrate with you.
of this slide and the next slide for all the programs for kids going into grades three through five next year. And remember, all of these programs are virtual. Ms. Tina will be running these programs and they include a program with the Sloan Planetarium called Witches, Wizards, and Potions, um, or Potions and Magic. You can step into another world full of wizards and witches and explore, design your own wand and cast magic spells and create potions along the way. Um, Sloan Planetarium will be joining us virtually, so make sure to register and grab your kit from the library on June 19th, and we will make some cool potions and wands together on June 22nd. Then uh, we will be doing Plant a Garden, and that program is on July 6th. You can pick up your supplies for that program from the library on July 3rd. Um, and we'll plant our own mini garden and see our plants grow and bloom all summer and into fall. You can follow along live on Facebook with Miss Tina for tips and tricks on how to get your garden to grow. Um, and there's more on the next slide. We'll be building a fairy garden. Since we're planting their garden, we'll need a cool fairy garden to go with it. Register for this program. Pick up your supplies from the library on July 10th and then on July 13th, follow along on Facebook Live with Miss Tina for tips and tricks. Please post pics of your fairy garden on our social media accounts when you're finished. Um, and the week after, we'll be doing a Sharpie mug decorating program. So you might need a grown-up to help with this one, and you need to register. And remember to pick up everything you need after you've registered, including a mug and Sharpie stencils and directions from the library on July 17th. Then on July 20th, you can follow along live with Miss Tina on Facebook, and you'll make some cool Sharpie mugs for those bonfire nights. And last but not least, lava lamps for a fun interactive science experience experiment you can keep. Join Miss Tina live on Facebook on July 27th and make your lava lamps. Remember, register and pick up your kit from the library on July 25th and time to make those lava lamps with Miss Tina on July 27th. And now for everyone's favorite part, the prizes. So this year we have 24 different prize baskets. But remember, you need to pick just one to go for when you register. So look at these next couple slides and pick out your favorites. There's a lot of cool ones like a unicorn basket, Lego basket, Star Wars basket. So pick which one you're going to go for before you register. And if you'd like to see more information about what's included in each prize basket, there will be a posting on the web library webpage, cidlibrary.org, and there will also be a posting on the Youth Services blog that lists out what it's in each prize basket and will show you pictures of all the items that are in each basket. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to pick out which prize basket you want and register for summer reading on June 15th.